next plant is number 53 on your list. This is Pinus ponderosa. So uh, ponderosa pine has a really wide distribution uh, among the places it's native are here in the Willamette Valley and the eastern part of uh, Oregon. And so there's actually uh, two varieties that I have t uh, trouble telling apart, but there is a Willamette Valley uh, a variety or, or botanical variety, and uh, as well as an eastern Oregon, uh, more dry land uh, variety. But they share a lot of uh, characteristics. Of the pines that we're gonna do this term, uh, Ponderosa has the largest uh, of the needles, and they are quite rigid. So they're quite long, quite rigid. This is a three needle pine, okay? So they're somewhat rigid, three needle pine, has quite a long um, uh, uh, fascicle here or, or um, uh, receptacle at the base of these uh, needles. The uh, cones of ponderosa pine are quite pointy. There's a sympatric or overlapping distribution species called Pinus jeffreyi, jeffrey pine. And one way that uh, a mnemonic device to, to tell the two apart is you have uh, pointy or prickly ponderosa and gentle jeffrey. So if you grab the cones of uh, ponderosa pine, they're extremely prickly and will uh, certainly, they're, they're not comfortable to hold on to, but the, uh, the, the outer spines on the bracts of uh, jeffrey eye actually bend over. So it's gentle jeffrey to your hand and uh, prickly ponderosa. But ponderosa pine is a quite um, uh, adaptable species. Again, due to that wide distribution, quite drought tolerant, and uh, excellent pine for the area, Pinus ponderosa.